I'm going undercover and I'm going to give my DVD to some talent scouts and hopefully, you know, they pick me up. I can start my career in the D League and really get this thing going. So wish me luck. So, know what you're thinking, right, Rudy? You'd be sneaky, but uh, I gotta do it. It's the only way they're not gonna recognize me from the video. But the plan is after they see the video, see how incredible it is, they're gonna come back and be like, man, how do we get a hold of this guy? Do you know this guy? And I'll be like, um, yeah, I do. <laughs> uh, I was working in my office and a gentleman stopped by um, in some very fake glasses and said he had a DVD of a basketball player. I watched the DVD and it was clearly him. So this guy stops by my office and drops off some game film, so I'm going to take a look and see what we got. And that's, that's the guy who dropped off the film. Yo, it's your boy Rudy Buckets. Are you ready to become an extreme baller? First, you gotta get down with the fundamentals. You know how in Space Jam, the monsters steal the basketball player's powers? I feel like that happened to Rudy Buckets, and he already didn't have much talent to begin with. Let's get tricky. I always practice trick shots. Let's say you're down five points with three seconds left. You gotta score fast. That's when I pull out a trick shot, baby. So that's clearly not a 10 foot hoop. Triple threat. It was invented by Bill Belichick. He called it the triple threat because he said defenders be tripping on this shit. <laughs> Every kid in America needs to know the quadruple threat. You can shoot. You can dribble. You can pass. And most importantly, you can intimidate. Keep that defender off of you. Bonus baller tip. Dribble with two hands for extra ball security. That's illegal. I always mix up my form every free throw to throw off defenders. I also like to maintain the mental edge over my opponent. The old, he has a gun! I'm not really sure he knows how free throws work. Or my favorite, fake timeout! Yeah. Now it's time for elite defense. Number one priority, protect the rim at all costs. Ah, this is my famous swap and swivel defense. If your man beats you, you can swap to the closest guy. And always check behind you in case a screen is coming. I feel like this is the only guy that believes in LeVar Ball. His ball handling was atrocious, his defense is completely misguided, and his intimidation part of the quadruple threat is frankly dangerous. It's not easy being the GOAT. Ball is life for me. Ball and swish, baby. One day, I will be a basketball master.